Greetings everybody, this is Blade the Hedgehog, and welcome back to Van Helsing. Now, last time I had Mitsuhide, which was an unexpected guest, but luckily I managed to have some answers, but I can actually get a hold of. Now, I did invite this guest coming in, and oh, speaking of her, there she is now. What took you so long, Rouge? Oh, sorry about that, Blade, but you know how G.O.N. is, they always like to pop things up at the last minute. <laughs> True. Now, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself to the, to the viewers. Oh, all right. Well, hello, my fellow treasure hunters. This is Rouge the Bat here, and definitely glad to be able to join in on this one here. Hopefully, it'll be something not as chaotic as it has been for a while. Yeah, well, I'm actually trying to get some answers on the whole Mitsuhide and Rosario situation. Would you mind cooperating with me? Mm -hmm. oh. I don't mind. As oh, long as, wait, again, you, like I said, as long as... Are you at the urge of remembering them? Hmm? Well, honestly, I can't remember those two, to be honest, aside from when I first <sighs> met Rosario a while back. But, oh, but, yeah, but, however, it seems like whatever Lavender did, there was a delayed reaction, but... At least I'm able to actually access all my feelings and emotions again. Huh, that's some good news. I did hear back at the uh, Devil May Cry stream that happened this past weekend. Yep, yeah, the poor girl. I, honestly, I got worried about her when she tried to use her power to help me out, but... However, like I said, a bit of a delayed reaction, but I th think it might be because of whatever... Uh, whatever potion had been used on me. Alright, well, as you can see, we just started, and now we are heading to Vasiria Church. Mm hmm. Now, Interesting. Since you're on the urge of being a demon huntress. Um, maybe... Mind telling me what it's like for you on your first experience? Well, the first ex experience... Well, honestly, it was quite surprising with how I am able to see actual demons compared to others, like those in video games here, and also those damn EXCs, but I gotta say, though, though I gotta say, though, when it comes to the, these deep demons right here, they're pretty much just like the EXCs. They're annoying and a pain in the butt, but you know what? They all have a weakness. I hope you're right. Mitsuhide actually got sets of things that actually treat, actually, um, actually kind of touched me a bit. Oh? He's saying something like about Raziel's devil side. I know you really don't remember him that well, but if you don't know who he is, he's um, a demon hunter as well. He's the one who trained you. Um, I. I am, oh, I am aware of that, um, let's just say that after I woke up after that sleeping powder had been put on me, Raziel did do some explaining, and honestly, I tried to, to I try to remember, but all it does is keep adding flashes, but he brought up his devil now side. that, yeah, I've, I said I've heard about that, but at least it connected the dots to talking about how. Mitsuhide. What would happen oh. if I killed Raziel? That's actually what fears. Me. I know this is surprising to your ears, but you're someone who thought I didn't have a fear, correct? With the way you've been acting, honestly. I wouldn't say you didn't look like somebody who would not be afraid, but rather someone who hides their fears rather well. I have my ways. Mm -hmm. Trust me, you know my roommate for a while as well. Mm-hmm. That I do. That I do. Like, are you shocked by this? Or, like, how are you feeling after I revealed that fear? Mm -hmm. 
Honestly, that put fear in my heart too. I may not remember about Raziel and myself, but You'll just know. hearing that, just, just hearing so. that, just hearing that he that he could be killed, really puts not just fear but sadness. Yeah, I guess Mitsuhide is right about that. You would turn your back on me, would you? It's all right to are be you really intent? It's all right to be are you really right. intending to kill Raziel? I don't know, Rouge. I just don't know at this point. <laughs> I can't just I can't kill a warrior cold blooded. Not that someone you <laughs> care about. Oh, well, we got some gargoyles now. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. <laughs> so, back to my- back to what I was saying. I can't I can't kill Radio. He might know anyway, I just care. I know what he's been going through. Even back at that, would you rather I did? Well, when we ended up in a mysterious world, I just don't know at this point, Rouge. What do you think I should do? I just can't back down from the fight. Honestly. I honestly don't know. And if I do kill him, I want your- I need your- I need your forgiveness. If I- That's I can, the thing. Hmm. I don't- I honestly don't know. If Raziel does get killed, I'd be devastated. I don't even know if- I don't even know if I could be able to trust others anymore, or Rouge, look at if me. I can be able to forgive. Don't forget, no matter what happens, mm -hmm. you'll still be a friend to me. I can still trust you. <laughs> Besides, I might actually want to see what you learn. <laughs> well, hopefully one day I'll be able to show you what I got. <laughs> Just one thing. Hmm? Don't hold back on me. Well, all I can say is don't take that word back. <laughs> I, don't, I don't take anything. Even if I, back with the point, um, even if I do split Raziel's demon side away from him, he's still gonna die by age. And then it comes to myself, there has to be another way. I do hope there is another way. If he does die by, if he does die by age, I do hope that at least he'd be... I do hope at least his aging would be just like ours here on Mobius. How long would that be? Usually a lot of people change when a year passes. Yeah, true. And, and usually the life expectancy for an average Mobian or an average human, usually it's about... Between 80 to 90. I used to. <laughs> I did know that. I didn't know I used to know uh, one little old lady who lived to be about 120. Who would that be? Oh, uh, somebody who uh, I consider as a grandmother figure to me. It was about a few years back. Hope I'm not making this conversation personal. 
Oh no, it's fine. You sure? I can stop talking about this if you want. I I'll be alright. I'll be alright. Like, need it since you're here. Would you like a drink? Oh, uh, sure. Sure. All right. What would you like? Oh, uh, let's see. Do you have any wines available? Uh, check in that cabin. All right. Oh. Well, at least there's one bottle left. <laughs> Wait. Let me inspect hmm? that. Where that somebody would have spiked it? When it comes to devils, I know how they could be triggered. Well, Look, just thing because is you, over. Just because you handled Rouge and XD doesn't mean anything. No offense. <laughs> It's fine. You can well, have it. All right. Well, I guess you. I guess it shows your belief in my ability, then. <laughs> <laughs> Trust me, I've been after these demons for, for, for centuries. Oh. Oh, well, how old are you, if I may ask? A thousand twenty. Uh huh. And yet you don't look a day over twenty. Yeah, still look like a young age. But wait, what's going on? Hmm? Oh. The hell? Are... Oh, that's Anna. Oh, the lady. The uh -huh, hell? I remember that lady. <laughs> Princess Anna. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, and there's three. There's nothing it looks like three vampire ladies, I think. The Brides of Dracula. Seems you've been doing your research. Again. Oh, that I have, that I have. You will be this time. After he has followed the princess to death. This is Anna Valerius? There is no way Anna's dead by the fact. But from this moment forward, consider I highly doubt she's dead. Oh, there we go. The bitch has gone crazy. <laughs> I gotta say though, this is some pretty good wine here. <laughs> from, my, from my dimension. <laughs> yep, yeah, seems like with all these other dimensions, they actually there's actually one thing that'd be able to improve besides age quality. Good wine. Thanks. I'll be sure to pass that. <laughs> That shield. Ah, dang. Alright, there goes Illyria. Hmm. One bag down. No, actually two. I'm facing a demon now. Oh boy. Demon Mashri? Marishka? How you say it? Mar Marishka, I believe? Yeah, Marishka. Don't know why it always sounds ger it's not German, uh, Russian to me. Maybe. <laughs> oh, come on. All right. Oh, 
stay in it. Oh. You got this, Blade. <laughs> of course I do. Hmm? Better be careful. No! Ah, oh, dang it. I almost... Uh. almost it's alright. It's alright, we'll try again. Just gonna skip that. There we go. Now we gotta take care of these two again. So far, so good. You all right, Rush? Oh yeah, I'm all right. Just uh, enjoying the gameplay and enjoying the swine here. Got my attention is Lavender Eating. Ah, uh, yes, her. I I've seen I don't know if I her, her a couple of times. <laughs> well, trust or not, at least she has been making sure to keep everyone in the loop when it comes to her own EXE brethren. All the XEs can be triggered, can be innocent, but they all have a weakness. They can all be, uh, evil. Take yours, for example. Well, not really well, innocent, but yours was actually kind of tricky. Well, she was evil from the start. Yeah. Not to mention, very manipulative. Ugh, thank- Alright, there, there we go. We got her. But as for Lavender.exe, she's quite an interesting one. Hmm. She had every opportunity to kill me, yet okay. she never took it. Throw it, there you go. And instead... She's dead. And she's dead. <laughs> but instead, no. Lavender.exe had made sure that I was prepared. Hmm. Even... What do you think had do mildly else? assisted with making life. sure that Rouge EXC or Devil Rouge the was yeah. trapped. Oh, well, well, Lavender EXC, you made sure to give me a warning to make sure to have myself protected. At first, I thought maybe it was the situation that had happened where pretty much a good portion of my memories have been eliminated. Turned out that wasn't really what she was warning me about. So think I know why. I, and I had a random with another EXE, Shadow EXE. My brother Vel can spend oh, years here in the church He's been on my hit down. list ever since I, I killed Brave EXE. Until he was bitten by a Six months ago. What did he do this research? Yep. <sighs> Turned out that GUN was giving me a heads up that there was some uh, intrusion going on, so it took me over to it took me over to some type of cave where there was flowers everywhere. And it looked like there was an encampment set up. However, I don't know the name of that place. Found out that's that familiar. Hello. However, I did see Shadow.exe there, and mainly he just been taunting me. And obviously, with how I am when it comes to a shadow, I've been trying to keep myself away from him. So I will. So I will say this. So turns out, turns out I definitely. I know that EXEs really hate water. 
not just holy water. Pretty much, it gets them agitated. <laughs> well, I handle it for you. Well, all I can say is that if if Shadow.exe decides to pop in whenever you're around, he's all yours. Hold on. Hmm? Um... Okay, you said the, you said it was an area where it was dark, had flowers, there was a cave... Yes. Hold on, let me think of the name and make sure if I'm right. Give me a minute. Oh, no worries. And if... I don't know if this will help, but the flowers in there look like they were all lilies. And when you look at the cave walls above you, it looked like that there were stars above you. Is it Patterson? Is that what the place is called? I believe so, yes. I've been there numerous times. I didn't know when EXE took over it. It's been, it's been years, actually. Well, wasn't sure whether or not it was a takeover or a temporary encampment. But still, I did investigate it further, made sure to send my info to GUN. They're pretty much also not taking any risks when it comes to these EXCs. Yeah, I'm guessing Raziel told you otherwise. <laughs> yeah, most likely. But also on top of it too, we although although when it comes to EXCs, I know I know if someone likes you, I understand if you don't trust them. That is completely understanding. Though Never said Funnily I enough. Never said I didn't trust them. I just felt they were kind of suspicious, to be honest. Uh, oh, I see we have a crossbow. <laughs> oh. Huh. Well, those, that definitely will come in handy there. <laughs> Indeed. Now, as you were saying. But, yes. Anyways, but however, we also, also for uh, Neo Team Dark, we are also trying to make sure that we're prepared too, and. We do have, we do have an EXC converted with us. What? Which Let's one just save. What's his name? Okay. Well, if you listen. I'm listening. He goes by the name of he goes by the name of Sark, but a lot of but a lot of people confuse him as Sonic.exe. Mm-hmm. Does he know what he's getting himself in? I, I did know he faced Sonic the XP, which was a terrible mistake. Yeah, that was a bit of a mistake there, but... At least he's out of there. However, we told him not to be pulling that crap again, and I even told him that if he needed my help or someone else who's... also an expertise when it comes to slaying EXCs to let us know. I'll help. All I can say is good luck. He's quite stubborn. Sonic EXE owes me a rematch anyway. <laughs> but I still need to reach that legend to see if it's true. Legend, you say? Didn't you forget about this form called Team I mean, uh, True Hyper? Oh yeah. That. <laughs> Not even sure if that's even... A true statement or not, but if that ends up as the case, then I think it's always better. Be Still, but at least be prepared just in case. Jeez, Jeez those owls almost killed me. Oof.
see if we can look around here, see if we can find something useful. Hmm? Nothing. <laughs> and I'm guessing the team leader of that team you're in is Chris, am I correct? Yes, that is correct. Again, the name is Neo, Neo Team Dark. Yeah, yeah, that. I'll be sure to have a talk. <laughs> well, all I can say is just uh, be careful and don't get electrocuted. You really think his lightning will affect me? Don't underestimate him. Trust me. Me, I know. Even the roommate knows. Hmm. And I think that the one, and I think that the one that has uh, the most ex the most experience. I know. Would... Zena. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Chris really needs to leave her alone. She's trying her best. What the hell are these broads? I know she's trying her best, but at the same time. It's quite annoying when you have a female version of Shadow doing what she can to, uh, how should I say, hit on you. Trust me, she's already hit on me quite a few times already. Thank God I'm not Sonic. <laughs> Dang it! But, you know, all I can say is that... <laughs> all I can say is that when it comes to her, I think that she gets inherited that from Shadow. Who are these? What are these things? They're like... If you don't know, um, they're... They're light blue, they have holes on their stomachs. I think they're like some type of spirit. I don't, I don't really know what they are. Do you know? I can't... Put the name on... I can't put the name on it. On those things. Hmm. I think they're, I think they're widows. I don't... I don't know, is either that or something else. I might be wrong. Hmm. Let's just let's just get moving. Good idea. <sighs> These uh, scar boys again. How are the guns? How are the guns I get to do? Well, so far, they've actually worked out pretty well here. <laughs> Though my, room, my roommate made those. <laughs> nice. Though I'm also trying to get used to some new, new ones too that I found hidden in my locker the other day. May I see that, please? Oh. Go on. Seem well made. Have you found these in your locker? Mm hmm. Uh. Honestly, I have no idea who they're from because these were also handcrafted, but. Judging I by. I know Tails didn't make them. I know, I was gonna say, judging by the engravings on them. I believe that Raziel may have snuck them in there. How does he know your locker combination? Hmm. I have no idea. Either he may have asked somebody higher up in GUN, or maybe he has his way of accessing it. <laughs> oh, his spirits again. Oh, hi. No, no, no need to apologize. You're good. How's, how's everything else? I do remember. Uh, the I do remember the last time you were here. Was it back in December, I believe? I think it was in December. Yeah, but oh but yeah, you could probably tell. Oh. oh yeah, you did that higher lower thing. Remember? Me. Yeah, I did. <laughs> yeah, otherwise, just been mainly uh, 
You know, just been mainly doing my own thing. Been uh, trying to make sure that the wedding with Knuckles and I was able to go well. Ended up it didn't. I heard. But uh, yeah. No and also on top of it too. Yeah, and on top of it too, finding out that my own exe ended up making a deal with the devil. And yeah, but otherwise, aside from this roller coaster and trying to piece everything together, it's been going all right here. Like I said, Devil Rouge might not be sealed for long. Don't but jinx it. I'm just predicting. Because I know how these things work. I know. I know. You may be a rookie at this, but, but take again. it from me. <laughs> I know. I you know. But still, best you don't jinx it. Because then otherwise, if you do... You might end up as a first target, so be careful. If I do, Jenkson, I dare them to fight. <laughs> I'll just send a one-way ticket back to hell. <laughs> well, speaking of Yankees, didn't a multiverse Sonic deal with her? That I have heard. All I can say is it was out of sheer luck, because at the time... I say it was out of pity. Well, if... No offense I, to him. No offense... Hang on, let me point this out. No offense to him. As, he he let it Rougie XD get in his head. Possibly. But still. But still, he's lucky to even be alive. Especially because her power, because the devil power at the time was only temporary, and he was able, and he was able to, and he was able to strike her down when she reverted back to her EXC form. That's the ghost of Valerius. Gabriel, you must let your Wow, and I'm guessing this is Igor. Torturous work is never done. Ugh. Well, well, well. If it isn't the murderer of the master's bride, mm -hmm. you've got quite the nerve showing mm -hmm. your face around here. Look who's talking. The master will be most pleased to have his revenge. But not before I have my fun. Oh, wait. What do you have to deal with now, Blade? Take a wild guess. More spirits? Igor. Ah. Uh. <laughs> you know, the guy who has a face only a mother could love? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Surprised that guy is still alive after what he pulled. Uh oh. Yeah, from what I've heard, he betrayed his master, the one who created the Frankenstein monster, in order to side with Dracula. Doctor Frankenstein. Mm -hmm. Is But, <laughs> I'll still need to gather answers if I still need to trust them. Yeah. I, I mean, I'm not even sure if I even remember me. I don't even know if I even met him. I mean, I can't even remember this guy, but I know that I'm having the bell. Yeah, but you'll know him once your memories are back. <laughs> Usually just takes a while. I'm pretty sure I know how that magic works, but surprisingly, I'm glad Raziel got his memory. Mm -hmm. At least you know him. Yeah, surprisingly, I do. I may not remember, but my heart does. Listen to your heart. <laughs> what I do. 
don't. Flashback can tend to haunt you. Good point, good point. I think that was the problem that you had. That I had? Yeah. What do you mean by that? I've been hearing that you've been flash you've been having flashbacks. I did for a while. At first it just started off as just dreams. But then they started presenting themselves in front of me while I'm awake. I and it ca it caused a bit of a headache. But however, when it, I've been trying to do a lavender spin and concentrate on my heart, the flashes went away, but However, her magic couldn't unlock all of my... Couldn't unlock everything immediately. As you told, as Instead, you told me, don't jinx it. <laughs> <laughs> though, I think though, when her magic finally kicked in and was able to break that lock on my heart... Honestly, when I tried focusing on my heart, it... It actually hurt. It literally. Almost, we're almost there. I felt like that something was stabbing me until. <sighs> until I did enough on just my heart. Oh. Almost died, but we made it. And it's. Oh, that's good news there. Oh, uh. <laughs> what the? Hmm. What's that sound? Whoa. That is a wait. I think that's Velkin. <laughs> did you did you remember Anna brought up Velkin when he was bitten by a werewolf? I uh, yeah her. That might be Velkin. <laughs> well, I guess we'll find out in the next episode. Actually. <laughs> oh, very well then. A man who yeah, can't well. so live with is no longer a man. <sighs> I'll need time away from these gameplays and maybe find some answers. Part human, part animal. That sounds like a good idea, but just try, try not to overdo yourself on finding answers. Show no mercy I can't promise you that, Rouge. For he is lost. <laughs> I don't expect one. <laughs> it's about time you know me. <laughs> well, everybody, I think this is where we will end it. So, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys do enjoy, leave a like down below, subscribe if you're new, click the notification bell, so you'll be the first to know whatever me, my roommate, or Goku, heck, even the Razor Jin, has some brand new videos for you. And, uh, would you like to say anything before we end this off, Rouge? I would say is if you definitely like what you saw, like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. And if you want to see some other gameplays from me as well, feel free to subscribe to my channel as well. I'll leave a link to your channel in the description below. And <laughs> very well then. And as always, this is Dragon. I was about to take my roommate's intro. Anyway, this is Blade the Hedgehog saying farewell. And stay safe. Okay. And this is Rich the Bat here saying, see you later, my treasure hunters. <laughs>